We are celebrating 30 years of Foncom. So Foncom just turned 30. Congratulations us. Celebrating that 30 years in any company is a big milestone, but in a company in an industry like ours is particularly special. This industry can be cutthroat, it can be very difficult, it can be very challenging, as fun as it is to work in it. And I do think being in this space for 30 years as a company is an incredible achievement. Um, yeah, it's, uh, it's been a, quite a journey. When I first arrived at Foncom, what I really thought was very cool was actually the offices. You could, you could feel like there is people here that love games. I think Foncom's always been a place since the day I started where you can make an impact, where you can leave a fingerprint on everything that you do in this company. I feel like my fingerprints are, are on the games that have come out in the past and I feel like everybody here has that opportunity. There are some, some moments that are special. Small moments with uh, people around me solving problems or making something happen that we didn't think was possible. Before Funcom I was washing cars in minus 25 degrees in Norway and then uh, I luckily managed to land an interview for a job as a quest designer. It was Age of Conan, um, Age of Conan Hyborian Adventures, a game that I remember very fondly. There are some moments that are vivid in my head from my time here. One of those is the Age of Conan launch day when we saw the amount of people that were coming into the game. They made funny videos and that's something we saw many years later with Conan Exiles as well and there was this particular video of a player on a horse and every time someone crossed the bridge, you'd have the horse to the kick, and you'd kick just the other players off the bridge, every time. And I remember us all watching that and just laughing, because of course we didn't expect that the player would be preventing the, the other players from, from progressing by just kicking them with a horse, because the horse would knock them back off the, off the bridge. One of my favourite times at Funcom was when we were working on uh, Conan Exiles and we were motion capping different animations for the game and I went into the motion capture studio and we had a compound bow there and uh, the, the mocap director let me play around with it a bit and I put an arrow through the wall about two feet. It was pretty fun. I remember Conan Exiles launch where we uh, were flabbergasted by the amount of players that were getting into the game, buying the game, and you know, the, the feeling when, after a very rough period where we almost went bankrupt, ended up breaking even on the Conan Exiles investment in six days. The amount of relief that I felt was uh, hard to describe. We're working with some fantastic IP. We're working with Dune, which has seen a great theatrical release, which as a big fan of the IP, I, I'm very happy to see. Dune Awakening is the newest game that we're working on. It's a massively multiplayer online survival game, and it's everything you'd expect us to make after Conan Exiles. You see this tendency of theme park MMOs and the survival games being kind of combined. There's really amazing aspects to both, and I'm very excited that we try to do that with Dune Awakening to merge the best aspects of both worlds.
So in the next 10 years, I hope Funcom will be a well-recognized name in the MMO, SOC, survival uh, type genre. Where I see Funcom in the next 10 years is continuing to create really cool and interesting worlds for people to explore. Doing so at a level of technical quality that we've never done before. So I'm really excited just to see where we can go from here as we grow. People should come to expect that if it's a game we make, there will be good social, fun multiplayer experiences. So I just want to say thank you to everybody, even if you were just someone taking a terrible quest I wrote from Age of Conan in 2008, to uh, people who play Conan Exiles and support us today, thank you very much to everyone. Thank you so much for creating videos, for sharing your streams, for sharing your fan art, for any content that you do. It's absolutely amazing to see that. Please never stop. And thank you so much for being with us on this journey.